There are more than 1 million electricity-guzzling refrigerators and freezers in Ontario. All of these delinquent fridges are over 15 years old and using electricity when they could be recycled, making life a little greener and leaving a little less at the landfill when all is said and done. This fridge has been picked up for recycling. First, technicians strip away any plastic, copper and aluminum. Plastic can be recycled to make lots of things, like flower pots. Copper can be recycled for copper wiring. And car parts can be made from recycled aluminum. Farewell to Freon. Refrigerators made before 1995 usually contain Freon. Freon, or chlorofluorocarbons, also known as CFCs, can destroy the ozone layer, which protects us against the sun's harmful UV rays. That's why safe disposal of CFCs is so important. Every fridge is drilled and tipped to drain the oil. And after all the oil is safely removed, it can be destroyed in an environmentally friendly way. It's baler time! Next stop, the industrial baler. It's used to crush refrigerators. One baler can crush as many as eight fridges at a time. Once the fridges are crushed, all of the steel is completely recycled and reused to help build bridges and roads. In the end, after every fridge is stripped of its recyclable materials, has had all its Freon safely removed, the oil drained and its shell crushed by the baler, very little goes to the landfill. And well, that's pretty amazing. What's more amazing is for every 15 fridges that are permanently removed and properly recycled, enough electricity is freed up to power a family house for an entire year. Our goal is to recycle just about 250,000 fridges and freezers across Ontario and in turn save enough electricity to power a city like Midland or St. Thomas for an entire year. So what are you waiting for? Book an appointment today and we'll come to your home and take away your electricity guzzling refrigerator for free. You won't have to lift a finger and you'll get to feel good about conserving electricity and helping the environment too.